All right, we are nine days away from the NFL draft. The Bucs, they're going to have the 27th pick in the first round this year. And tonight, sports anchor Kyle Berger spoke with Bucks GM Jason Light on how the team plans to attack the draft. Bucks GM Jason Light is really good at not giving up much information other than all options are again on the table. With Tom Brady back at quarterback, the Bucks are all in at winning another Super Bowl, but Brady's unretirement won't affect their draft day plans. It changed maybe a little bit of how we went about free agency. Um, and, you know, we had a lot of players that we wanted to uh, bring back, which we were successful in doing. The Bucks still have several unsigned free agents, including tight end Rob Gronkowski and defensive tackle Andamakan Sue. Light says he can't work under the assumption they will come back. Well, you have to keep that in mind, but you also never really want to push a need or a perceived need too high up. And that's where you start making mistakes. With Todd Bowles being named head coach so late in the offseason and Bruce Arians taking a front office role, draft strategy won't change. It's just been meeting more with Todd now as the head coach, um, more one on one and more in some group settings too. Bruce has still been involved, he's been in our meetings. Um, I meet with Bruce, you know, periodically, um, and he's going to be involved here as we put the final touches on our draft too. The Bucks will have the 27th pick on Thursday. That means they could be waiting three to four hours to finally make that pick. To occupy that time, Light says he'll be eating, unfortunately. In Tampa, Kyle Berger, ABC Action News.